Hello YouTubers and happy Labor Day and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars custom diecast review. Today is Lightning McQueen Day, which the date itself is to match the racing number of Lightning McQueen and this year marks the fifth anniversary of the special day of Lightning McQueen himself and and on top of that it's to commemorate the Cars movie franchise on social media like Instagram and so forth and however anyhow today we're gonna take a look at the Raceorama Lightning McQueen from the Cars Raceorama video game. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, <clears throat> Lightning McQueen took on this paint job and customization, but with a different spoiler alert, for the final showdown against Chick Hicks at Radiator Spring Speedway, of which he won, he won the race against Chick Hicks, and told Chick that there, that there was more to racing than winning at all costs. But Chick, sim who was ignoring, ignoring Lightning's advice, was furious and, and stated that he will be back for revenge. Then a little later, Stainer, along with Candace and El Machismo, came to apologize of their actions on the racetrack. All, but Stinger just simply wrecked his engine in replied to Lightning's exception of their forgiveness, as well as their apologies. And he, he also wore this paint job in the Cars Storybook Collection titled Double Trouble, which is based off of the Cars book Crash Course. And let's take a look at some pictures. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So, here we've got his... smirking, determined facial expression, his headlight stickers and his, with a black 95 on a white circle on one of them, and the re his traditional bright red exterior paint job and the the hood scoop on the hood and the top scoop on top and on both sides we've got the gray rims on the black wall tires and the yellow light retro lightning bolt with the with the, the traditional yellow 95 and the gas cap and on the top, we've got his yellow, traditional yellow name signature, and we've got the, the flat spoiler. And on the back, we've got the exhaust pipes, and whatever that black thing is, let me know what you think in the comments down below. And the taillight stickers with a black number 95 on one of them. 
and we also have the lightning bolt stickers and I know they're supposed to be yellow Hello. I'm not perfect please don't get mad at me and now let's compare them to the other Lightning McQueens so here we've got the regular Cars 1 Lightning McQueen and as you can see here both are Lightning McQueen both bear the the both wear the bright red paint job and the and the headlight stickers Rusty's logo on hood no Rusty's logo on hood 95 on top top scoop and both carry the yellow name signature and the lightning bolt stickers and the headlight stickers yellow 95 black 95 on white circle Yellow, both bear the yellow retro lightning bolt with the traditional yellow 95 light year tires. Tuned rim tires. Ducktail spoiler, flat spoiler. Rusty's logo on back. No Rusties on back. And now, and now for the Radiator Springs Lightning McQueen. So, as you can see here, both have the black 95 on a white circle with black border lining on their headlight stickers as well as on the back but here are some differences but here but the main th the thing is this L McQueen is dark red while this McQueen is bright red and now for Motoropolis Lightning McQueen so As you can see here, both again, both are Lightning McQueen. The third time, although I forgot to mention the Radiator Springs Lightning McQueen for that the that these two are Lightning McQueen. The second time, now these two paint jobs, which Lightning McQueen wore during the Racerama game. And lastly, but definitely not least, the Cars 2 Lightning McQueen with racing wheels, of which these two look similar. And, and in fact, these two share the same die cast mold. Mold, mold. And they both have the gray rims on the black wall tires. But here, but here's another difference. Light year tires, not light year tires. And both have the flat spoiler at the very back. And and also I want to me and I also want to mention that I made this Racerama Lightning McQueen out of a duplicate Cars 2 Lightning McQueen with racing wheels. Oh, and another, th and here's another, and here are some other things. On this week, to tomorrow, it marks the uh, marks the day of the Pine City stage. As well, and the day after tomorrow is the day that Clint Eastwood had perished, which those two days appeal on, occur on the same year, 1885. And on 
and on the 8th, in three days away, is Disney Plus Day, and, the per which, and, al and also the premiere of the new Cars on the Road series. Although, speaking of Cars on the Road, I'm desiring to get a the Cars on the Road 4-pack from, tar from a Target store. And, and I'm also desiring the fabulous Lightning McQueen. But other than that, what do you guys think? Which Lightning McQueen is your favorite? Let me know what you think, as well as leaving suggestions of which card to review next in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And also don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. Oh, and I also forgot to mention one more question. Have you guys enjoyed the Cookout Southern 500 at Darlington Raceway, Darlington Raceway yesterday? Let me know what you think in, in the comments down below as well. So, anyhow, without any further ado, Happy Lightning McQueen Day and Happy Labor Day, and goodbye now!